So when you get onto your, your domain, your Namecheap account, what you have to do is that to change your name server for the domain you want to do, you want to change for what you have to do is you, you click on the domain, come to where they say manage here. Let me increase the screen brightness. You see where they say manage, click on the manage, and then it will bring you to this part. Now, once you are in this part, what you have to do is you're going to come where it says name server. This is your name servers here. Now, your name servers is what connects your domain name, which is this one, to your server. Okay. Name servers is what connects your domain name to your server. Your server is like the land where you are going to build your world, your website. Then the the sorry, your hosting is land where, where you are going to build your site. Then the domain name is the house that you are building but now now you know that for the you know for that house to exist now you need your foundation now let's just assume that our foundation is going to be like our what our name server so what is our name servers our name server works by you know by assuming the ip address of our what of our server okay so this one now here now i have a server here but if it's on my other uh, i mean server provider which i call uh, say contable I'm not using Namecheap hosting at the moment. I'm using Contable hosting. So to do what I want to do now is that I want to connect this domain that is on my Namecheap account so that I can be able to use my server that is with what? With Namecheap. So what I would have to do is that I have to come here now and at this section where I have this domain now, it is currently, if you have it here now, it, is, it, it, it should be at the basic DNS just like this now. That is the way it will be like. It will be showing this uh, Namecheap basic DNS. So click on this drop down here change it to custom DNS. So once you change it like this now, you can now put in the app, the IP I'm going to show to you just now. Okay. So let me know if you are there. You can actually drop me a message or a chat on our meeting chat so I can know that, okay, you have actually gotten to that point and then I'll proceed. Okay. Now that you're on name chip, I said, if you can't, can you see my, now can you see your dashboard like my own like this? Can, 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 can you see it like this? Okay, so if you are if you are logged into your Namecheap account, you are in fact your first place to land on will be your dashboard, and then once you're on your dashboard now, you'll be seeing something like dashboard expiring and expired. Then you've seen the main list, so you're yes. Now on the domain list, now you're going to find the domain that you bought. I think your one should be dot online or whatever. So when you find it now, you you see this something at this other side, the way they wrote, I think your owner, as a trader, you should write manage. So, so click on the manage now. Click on the manage, and then it will take you to the next page. Now, on this next page now, you'll be seeing something like this here. Can you see this domain, product, sharing, and transfer, and then you'll be seeing advanced DNS. Are you seeing like that? Okay, so now I am going to have to connect uh, your domain to Cloudflare. Cloudflare allows your domain to what, to propagate very, very fast. So that is why I'm going to come here. It's like, an, because you know, domain now you see, the propagation actually takes about 24 hours, but with Cloudflare, it will happen in just five minutes and then you can start building your site easily without wasting time. So when I'm now on Cloudflare, I'm going to click on what, on add a domain. I'm here because I've already built my, you know, my profile. You can see that I have a lot of services running here already. So I will just click on what, add a domain, and then I'll add your domain here. Your domain is uh, progobium.online, right? So I will just, okay, I've put it there and then I'll say, okay, continue. Now when I click on continue, it would take me to the next page. And on this page now, I'm going to have to choose the free account because, of course, we don't want to start paying them cheap now. You know, we cannot afford to pay them. You know, we are just trying to learn cloud and be able to, you know, can can we able to eat what I go? So now, now it will now show me my my existing DNS record. Now the DNS record, I what I you know, I what I, what 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 we are going to put in this in this our name chip here now. Okay, this one now is the name is in, is the name server record for this is the DNS record for this domain name. So just just hold on here. I'm going to have to send you the DNS record when we are done. So let me go back to my Cloudflare and then finish up properly. So this is what we have here now. This is what your IP address is at the moment, and it is pointed towards the to name chip server. So what I'm going to do is that I'm going to go. I'm going to have to, to delete all of them. No, I think I will remain some. 
I will remain the one that has to go go with the. Uh, I think this one, this this two here goes to Google Cloud. So this one and this one and this one can remain. But the other thing here can what can be deleted. So I will delete this first six and do what? I'll write delete. And then I will say okay. I'll just add it. Then I can ask okay, continue to activation. Okay. Now at this point now the domain will be what it will be stationary. Now let me give you what you're going to put on your under your DNS. Now you see this thing I'm going to send to you now. Put it on your DNS, Mr. Umesi. So I'm copying the first one. These two things you're going to put them on the first slot and on the second slot, Mr. Umesi. So pay attention. I'm sending it now. Uh okay, let me one to so Mr. Umesi, take this take now. You are going to take this DNS record. This is the first one. So on the first feud, now let me show you the first feud. You see this first line here. You paste all of now everything that I've sent you now. You're going to paste it on the first one here. Then I'm, I'm then I'll send you the second one to paste on the second line. Okay. So this is the second one, which is look.ns.name. I mean dot cloud dot, dot, dot com. So it's coming now. I've pasted it here. So this is the first one, the second one. So now go now. I've pasted these two now. So copy the first one go to your domain name at this point here okay this place here paste it here then the second one still come back here and do what and paste it when you're done now you see a small check sign or a good sign at the, at the side where, where you have this red sign here you do what you just simply click on it to save what you've just added there when you've done it now then you let me know now that you've connected your domain name now, now that you connected your dns from Cloudflare to your to your domain name, it is not time for me to say okay. I will not say okay. Now I will not say okay. Continue to tell them that what well, that I've actually connected the whole stuff here. So they should what they should continue for me. Then I will now continue. Now when I continue now, they have to say okay. Maybe they will not be waiting for me to what to maybe to to, to 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 finish up everything here. So I will see. I will just simply just continue what I'm doing here and then just ignore them and continue. So. But before then, I have to come here and do what and tell the domain what I want it to do for me. So this is just me telling you to use HTTPS, which is that BK that you normally see on the site whenever you are doing your, you know, you are, you are browsing through your website and all that. So now I'm going to give you something else to what to work with. But for now, pay attention. Okay, just pay attention. So to build our site now, we now have our domain name pointing to what pointing to to this to this cloud flare now okay now there's something called our dns record here this is now this is our dns record here at the moment you can see our dns record is here now but it does not have any ip address to any server here because we have not added anyone here that is why if you open this your site now what is the site name again self um let me copy it out so that i can be able to now if you check your site now mr umesi where is your site again okay you Pro, uh -huh. pro go boom. Um, this is your site. If I bite my tongue, my village will go hold you. They will come and hold you because I don't come out if I. So this is your domain name at the moment. It's not going to show me anything. It will just be running and running. You see now, you say it cannot be reached. Okay. So I have to put in a what an IP address belonging to a server. Like I said before, a server is that place where you are going to where you are going to build your house. It's like your plot of land on the internet. Why your domain name is the house that you're that you're building? Do you understand now? So you see now, it's just turning. It's not going anywhere at all. It's not. In fact, it's just rounding and rounding and rounding. It, and it will not say your site cannot be what cannot be reached. You say it took too long to respond. Yes, because it is not linked to any land. In fact, you never see land by. So let me now go and assign it a land to what to work with. So I will now come to where I have my IP addresses and I will do what and I will assign it a what. I will assign it a what a plot of land. It's very to work with so i will come here i've copied my ip address and then i will go back to cloudflare and declare my what my land and i will tell Cloudflare that okay now i have gotten a word i've gotten a plot so i'll come here and i'll add a record and then i'm just going to be adding a a record you see i'll come here and i was okay the first one is is going to be asterix and i'll put the ip address okay i'm not declaring where i want to build my house now and i will say save there are three, you know, you know, you know, here now it must be three things that you're going to add here. Then I'll add another one again. I will say, okay, this one should be www. No. It will be www. And I will do what? I will paste the IP address again and I will say, okay, save. 
Then the next one will be what now? It will be your domain name. Let me paste this one first. This one, and then I will put your domain name, which is a pro progobium here. I don't know whether. Please, oh, you have to remind me again if. Okay, progobium. I was correct to dot online, so I think I got it now. So I will go back to it. This is it here. I'll come back here and put progobium dot online. And I'll click what? I'll click on save. Then the last one should be my email server, which will come as an NX, I mean, an MX record. This is it here. And I will put your domain name, which is pro, pro, progobium dot online. And then the next one will be what? Will be mail dot progobium dot online so this one means that what that my site will not be what then i'll not put my priority here which is what i will just put uh, 56563 and then i will say okay save now at this point now your site now has somewhere to what to land on so if you come here now and you go to that domain name again you say okay pro go boom dot online i think it will start showing something now because it has been what linked to somewhere check your own from your site and then tell me what you saw please because I think I, I think I have, I have a lot of catching issues here. It's, it's always wounding me in terms of in terms of working on a site. It's always been wounding me anyhow. So someone left me a message. Let me go and read the message. I don't know what the person is saying. Um okay, Chiamaka uh trading shorex. I don't know this person. So trading shorex, what is your question? Now our domain is now pointed into a what? Into a server. Let us now go and start our our building properly okay we are now going to go back and what and finish up properly so now i have connected all our you know all our all our normal investigation with our dns and all of that are all what they are all done properly and corrected so we cannot come back to what to our here and do more work here okay so let us now come and add our site here so we will now come back to our server and add our site. You can see now they say here, they say add a site. This is our server. On a normal day, you are supposed to set up this server. That was, you know, he did that, he did that one yesterday. This is the Linux server. You're supposed to set it up from beginning. Like, you know, you are supposed to run the code, to, you know, to, to set it up. But in another class, again, I'm going to demonstrate the same thing using another kind of server that you can actually see me setting it up as it is that one does not need much process like this again but we are still going to do the same cloud flare and all of that so let us now connect our domain name into our server properly the one we did here was our what our dns this one now is our what is our dns linking it up to to cloudflare okay and then managing our dns in our in our domain name by coming into our our name chip account here like this so let us now go forth and here now we will not come and add our site here. So let me add our site. So you can click here where it says add a site. Let me make this bolder. So I'll make this bolder here. So this is where we're going to add our site. So I'll click on what? On add site. Now, at this point, now I'm going to have to do what? I'm going to add your site here, which is your what? We call it pro gobium dot online. Okay. I've not added it here now. So I'll do what? I will say, okay, confirm. Now, once it is confirmed now, your site will already have a what? A folder here. This is your folder here. You remember that yesterday, Mr. Minjir I mentioned something like, you know, like folder, right? Now, you now have a folder. So, this is your site name here. You see, it is running here. And then, there's no backup for it. And then, it's saying what? Well, this is your document route. That is the, the document that you're going to upload that we are going to download from that side that you showed us. You see, you see this document here now that we have here. We are going to have to do what now? Download it and what? Put it on that folder on this server once you do it now your site will become live okay so you can see that actually it's more simpler the only thing that we did there now that is you know that is more difficult is what is the is the domain name and is in fact is the dns that we just have to go and you know and manage here yeah, that is the only thing that we did here that is a bit different or difficult but don't panic you can still get it okay just pay attention it's as easy as abc now this is our site now this is it here now, before this site can run now, we need to go and do what now? We need to go and create our, what, our database, okay? You can see that here now we have database here, right? So I need to come back here and do what? And have my database here because for this site to run now, it must need a what? Database. You must put in a what? A database here, okay? So let us see. But 
What we as smart use it to that day now, this one here does not actually work with a database. So even if you don't have a, data, a database on it now, it can still be able to run. But just know that if you are going to host it on a WordPress, because tomorrow or in our next class, I might say let us do it with that. I mean, let, let us do it on another server that will cause the world to have a database first of all. So you need to come here and build a word database for your world, for your site project. But for now, let us just go and do our things properly. So I will come back here. This is my route for this site. See our site here. This is the route where I'm going to upload the site file here. So I'll open it. Now I have opened it. This is what it looks like at the moment. So that is why if you go to your this night to be showing you that your site actually is what it's actually online. Let me show you. Say pro go beam dot online. Something is wrong. So let me check what is wrong here. How to manage your DNS again. I have to manage the DNS and be sure that actually it is correct. And if it is wrong in any way, I have to make sure that I correct it. So I'll open this one to be sure what I did. So where is Prodogo Beam? Okay. So this is what I did here. I I came to DNS here. I'm just trying to confirm what I did. Please don't. So I have star DNS. I also have star here. And then I have the domain name, which is this. It is here. Then I have WW, which is this one. I also have WW here. These are the three most important that I need. So that means everything I did there was correct. Please check on your site, sir. Is the domain displaying anything from your site? Because of catch, I'm not able to see properly. So now, this is a small recap now. We have actually changed our DNS, um, connecting our site to a server. And to hasten the DNS propagation, we had to use, um, you know, Cloudflare. Now, let me tell you something about Cloudflare again. Cloudflare actually acts as a what? As a shield. Let me show you what I mean here. You know, what it does is that what? That it filters your network, okay? Sometimes when you go to a site and they tell you that your site is, you know, you know they will tell you, okay, we're trying to know whether you are a bot or whatever. That naturally is done by what? By Cloudflare. Okay, so there's a way I will change this in now, and then your site will start showing. We are trying to verify that you are not a bot. That is what Cloudflare does for you. So it, it, it does what it filters your network so that people cannot be able to what to you know to get access with your what with a bot. Okay, so that is what it does for you. So let me open uh let me open this site so you can actually see what it looks like with this one. So you can actually see it filtering traffic. So I go so now can you can see what is going on here now? Did it, this one is my word. It's my traffic being filtered by what? By Cloudflare. So it's only allowed the word now that only the normal human being can what can get to your site. You can see it now. So now let us now go back. Now this is our site here now. So for us to be good now, now for us to be able to upload what we have, uh, you know, from that, uh, from that uh, this thing now. For now to be able to use this one now that we have here now, we have to do what now? We have to clear this server for this site now. So we have to delete everything that is here before. You are going to come in here, select everything that we have here and do what? And click on what? Delete. Click on more and do what? Click on delete. Wait, something is wrong. It's not showing what I want to see. So I will select everything now. I will come back here and click on delete. Just to clear it. So that that, 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 that she was showing us now will not be able to show again. Okay. So now, let me now go and what? And upload what Mr. Smart said that we should use. So I will come in here and I will click on what? upload now what am i going to upload i will select it come here and say okay upload a file then i'll come to my system now these are my documents here and i want to upload this one you see now this is a zip file that we collected so that you can see that now remember that he said upload zip file or download zip file and then unzip zip file and all of that you're not going to see those things in action now but the only thing that is that what you're not using anything like a code you are doing it and you are seeing what you are clicking on is that not wonderful hallelujah so let me now just okay so let me say okay now 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 i want to upload this file and you can see that this is a what is a zipped file so i'll click on what i'll click on open now i've actually uploaded it now and it's going in you can see that the thing will start reading here now i think my network is maybe my network is not fast enough today so let me just click on upload okay you see it's been uploaded and then we can say okay now let us remove that now this file is now existing here so you know that yesterday now you now click on See, see, like, see, like, see, that, 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 he now said, okay, he now said, okay, LS to see the folder now. This is our folder now. So, now, 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 
we don't need to like maybe say use any kind of uh, maybe say bash code or whatever but in another class that we're going to have i'll do the same thing with a with a bash code for you to actually see that actually the thing they flow so this is now our what our site file now the next thing is what is to unzip this file okay so let us unzip the file so i will come in here click on the name of the file and then go towards this other part here you see unzip here can you see unzip see unzip here can you see on zip here? Let me let me zoom in so you can see it clearly. Can you see on zip? Okay, so if I use on zip now, you see that what well, that it is going to what well, it's going to unzip the file so that I can actually see what is on the con you know it's on the file on this side. So I will click on what say confirm the what on zip. You can see just about a few seconds and our site is what it's already unzipped. Okay, now it is now unzipped. But remember that he said delete so you know one folder and then you know you say copy the other folder and do what delete one folder. Remember that in yesterday Abby? Do you remember it? Now we are going to delete this particular folder now. Okay, we'll tell it what to delete it. We don't need it here. See, okay, you don't finish your job or you're called a go ass. So we'll do what? Delete it. Because we now have all we want, what we now need. So this is what we need here. So we cannot do what me now i will come into this folder and i will do what i'll copy everything inside the folder let me go back to my normal view so now i'm now here i will do what i will say okay i will highlight everything that is here it's not the color so i'll do what i will say okay i will i will say okay copy or move i'll just say i think i will say okay cut if i say cut it will give me some kind of Maybe some kind of little little issues. I have to rename again. So I will just say, okay, move. But there's no move here. Let me just say, okay, cut. Now I've cut it now. I'll come back to the to, you know to the main folder of this site and I'll do what? And I will paste it in here. See paste here now. And I will paste. Now you see everything is now pasted here. Then I will do what? I will delete this one that is here. This one is the folder that we copy from now. This one. I have to delete it so that I'll have I will know where I am. May not confuse me, Abby. So I'll say okay, delete. Remember how we deleted it the first time. So we click on here, delete, and I will say confirm. Now, Mr. Messi, go and visit your site again. Let us see. And the person that saw the site before, please go back again. Let us see whether something is showing there now. Something magical. Something anointing us. Hmm? Something minimious is showing there. Check it and tell me, please. Yeah, private to Okay. I know why that is showing because I did not install SSL. That is the reason, but I will show you how to install SSL. Just just confirm that it's showing there. Is it showing there? See, once it show you that in there, click on that advance or proceed. You're going to see the site. Yes, you'll be able to see the site properly. So now this site now is what is properly live. The site is showing live. Whether Mr. Messi agrees to it or not, the site is what is live. Whether I see it here from my own machine here or not, the site is what is live. Uh, no worry. It's because you are still enjoying the catch that is, you know, is he showing you the, you know, you are, you are, you are you can, see my own here now. Can you see? I can't even view it here. That is how it is. That's why I was asking people to help me to view it on, from your own side that time that is so you don't feel like maybe i'm just trying to like somebody, somebody was like okay just show off like someone to i'm not trying to show you that i cannot view it here and in my house here now we use a uh, wife you know we use wi-fi so as far as we did that same network now this thing will just be corrupting everybody's this you cannot see the current version of the site that is the reason why you know i had to ask people that are not on my network to be able to use it so that's just the way it is so you can see now it's still delaying but people are already seeing the current version of the site that is just a funny thing about the whole stuff okay are we there? GPS in your what? In your site. So I will go back. This is our server. Then I will go to my website and I will come to where it says, you see where it says SSL here? I will click on it. And so I will go to let and scripts and I will do what? It will is through. Are you Are you Cosa? Okay, so I have, I'm sharing. Can you see my screen? It's like network is bad today, actually. It's like, it's like, it's like network is bad. I, I, I don't know why. 
see the screen now? All right, so let me go back to my server now. So in order for me to change and install SSL, I'll come to my server. You can see that. Let me make it bold so you can actually see. Okay, now this is my server, and I have to go to the to the to the SSL section of the site. Can you see SSL here now? It say not set. So I need to set it for the for, for the site to become what to become properly what open to everybody without telling you that it's not secure, or whatever. So I will come in here now and I will say, okay, you see this not set, I will click on it. Okay. Now this is where I have to what, set up everything here. So I will come here and say let's script. See this let's script, I will click on it. And this is what is telling me now. So I will say, okay, I will select the site I want to install it on. And I will do what? I will say apply. You see now? And I will say what? Apply and what? And open. So this one will not do what? It will not take time to what? To install the SSL script that I want it to be there. You see that key that you normally see on every website? This is how to install it. So this is your SSL. You install it on your what? On your server end. In other words, if you don't have a server, you cannot do what? You cannot install SSL. So this is how it looks like. This is this. You see, this is what? This is the private key. And this is what this, the certificate that is being issued to you. It's not like your university certificate though. So, but for it to start working instantly, I have to do what? I have to force HTTPS by what? Clicking here. So I'll force the HTTP and I'll do what? And I'll what? click on save. Now from your own part now, it should start working. So please, the person that showed us before, go back and check again, let us see. Or someone else can, can show us from the system. Let me show me because I will make sure I can be happy that the site actually is working. So someone should go and show us because I've actually done what? I've actually installed the SSL. It's showing properly now, Abby. Are you using an iPhone? Uh huh. Now they do that kind of thing quickly like that. But we that are on Windows and Android, sorry you. We go day here. The rules come. It's showing now, Abby. So, Mr. Messi, do you now see it from your side? Is it showing on your side? Mr. Messi, are you there? Hope you're not jumping. Okay, let me now change all this. So, you know, this is you know, you know, the yesterday, Mr. Smart said that we are going to change it and pull whatever I want it to see. That one can actually take you like two hours to because me, I've been doing my own since. You can see my own here now. Where's my own that time, sir? I don't forget where I live now. So, see my own here now. I, I, I did it on my like cloudmeter.com. Hey, well, you see, see, taking me back to what it was before now. This one, the one. This, this, now, this, this, this is the one that, 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 that I was showing you today, but I've changed it already now, but it's still taking me. I'm more tired for cash my system. I've been using moon me anyhow here. Yeah. So let me change it. I'll come here and check it again and see if it is displaying properly. So I'll check here, refresh. Let's see. Ah. Oh, till I don't finish nothing. You know they show me anything. So that is just the way it is. I cannot view my current this in here. But if I show you on my phone, now it's actually showing properly on my phone. That is just the way cash behaves. It can be there for 24 hours, 48 hours. It's because it won't, won't enjoy you for there. You, you, you know, we just that. so that's why we people that developed now we use happily. In fact, we normally have many devices. If I use, if I see on my phone, I to be showing properly on my phone, but I don't want to start that stress now. So, so can you see your screen now? Can, can, can you see that your site actually is working fine? Can you see it? Okay, fine. Let me go and get a picture of yours and then put it on your site so you can actually be happy that ha ha ha, you have done something. Let me where's our group? This is our group. And you are Mr. Uh, okay, this is you here. Uh, yes, this is, is this one not you. Let me copy it out. Even though this is not the real you, and you know, that like, is not your real face. This is not your real face, sir. Okay, let me copy it out so I actually can you can see. Oh, ho, ho. <laughs> so let me copy it out so you can actually see something. So I will save it. So I will bring this one out. So there's something again that I want to show you guys that actually can make you start to have headache now. But just don't panic, okay? Don't panic too much. They will have IT team that can do that for themselves. That one cannot be your job. So I will save this now. Then I will go into your into the site and then put your face in there. So let me. This is it here. I will come back here and no. This is it here. So this is your site now.
this is a website i have to go into the into the root again remember that everything you have to do on your site you have to work on your what on your root folder your root you know that root now is the most deepest part of what of every three rb so that's where everything begins so you need to go back to your roots and do what and do some kind of manipulation here okay so i'm now in your server now this is your this is your site this is your site so everything you are seeing there is being controlled by what there's a small file called index are you seeing index here this is where everything there is working here okay so but first of all now something happens here that i want you guys to see your site's resources are what in different folders here so for your face to be able to show on the site i have to put your face into what into this into this image folder here so you see this is our server this is our ww root and then this is our site's main roots and then this is your site now i'm viewing your what the image folder of your of your site so i will come into the image and i will say okay i will have to upload your image here so i will say upload this is my upload here and i'll upload your picture so i'll click on upload file and i'll come to my desktop and this is your face here but i need to name it the way i the way i want to be able to you know to, to be able to make reference to it is so i will just say i'll just say oh mercy no it's, it's actually an s we may see one then i was okay then i will now click toward to import it in so i will click on there and then i will say upload so it's a messy one i have to go and change it at the front end so i will upload i think it's already uploaded now you can see your umessi is here this is it here umessi one okay now let me go back to the to the site folder now for your face to appear on the front page have to edit this this uh, you know use this index in this use this index dot html file this is what i have to edit so i'll click on it and i'll click on edit and i'm here now i have to change it so whatever happens that you see on the site is going to be changed from this part okay so i have to come back here and i will change it to your name this in here has to go okay so i'll come here and i'll say okay um this one should be what's your name again your name is uh Messi, um, let's say DevOps professional, or oh, let me also say De De DevOps. Then I'll come down to this place where I'm going to be able to see your picture and all of that. And this is your name here. You say you say you are Kate Abby, but I will change it. I am Umesi. What is your other name, please, sir? Umesi, what? Okay. You are Mr. Umesi God's will. Okay. Now, this is where you now put what you are doing. If you are a web developer, you can put that here. It's okay. You are a dev uh, sec ops engineer. This is that thing that you see that is running around the site. This is it here. Okay. You can say, okay, that is what you do. And then maybe you also do other things like maybe you do graphic design. Say, okay, graphics design and probably you also do some kind of content creation say uh let's say uh content creation and probably you also do import and what and export so you can say okay imports and what and exports and probably you also do what you also do stuff like mr miss what do you do normally real estate real estate okay so this is what you do so once you check it now to be sure it will be you know it will be flying up and down it will just be turning so now i have to change your image here this is now this is where your image actually shows okay so i have to change your image here so what is the name of image that i have there the name of image is i don't know whether it was a pdf i didn't check it but let me save my progress for me yes i know it's on it's on the message but i didn't know the file essentially whether it was a p okay let me go and check for my my desktop let me check my desktop i think so i don't have to waste so much time i'll go back okay it's actually a gpg file so i will come back to my server and then do my manipulation so now this is your file i have to change the file name here which is what umesi umesi one and then you say what it's a jpeg so i have to change it one to jpg and what it will be able to uh, to enter this. I can just say, oh, mercy. This one is not necessary. Okay. Oh, mercy one. So now, if you check now, if, if I save it now, your face should be what? should start showing there. So I'll just come here and put it again. Oh, mercy one. And it's a JPEG image. So when you check again now, 
So I can put, I can change one to what, maybe 30 years of what, of experience. Oh, sorry. I think my this thing don't fuck me up. So let me come back here and I will say, okay, cool, mercy one. And then I wanted to change this one to what? No, this thing here is playing with, I think my, I mean, I'm using the number tab on my, on my laptop. So it seems messing me up. So I will change it to oh, mercy one. What the heck? Come on, no. If you really want to fuck me up, eh? J. P. G. What the hell is going on? Something is wrong somewhere. I have to, I have to exit this place. Something is wrong. Please, someone should check the side whether this is showing yet. With the, I'm just with his face. Cause me, I cannot check. If my own is not working. I mean. It's not allowing me to do anything here. Is he showing with his face? Maybe because I've not really saved. Let me save and then see what happens. So check now. Let's see. Does he show his face yet? Does he show? Okay. Okay, no problem. You see the same thing I did before. I can do it again. But you know, it will keep it will keep frustrating. Okay, this is what I have here. I have Umesi one dot jpg. This is out. Okay, I think we should be able to get it now. I will change this one to Umesi one. Okay, then. I think you should start showing. Let me save it again and then continue. So I think you should start showing now. Check for me, please. Just refresh and check. Refresh. Can you check? Is it showing? The image is not showing yet. Something is wrong somewhere. Don't worry, to show. He's trying to fuck me up, but I'm not gonna love fuck me up. Ah, <laughs> that is actually what I have to change. There's nothing else I have to change here. That is what the only thing I have to change here is that one. So I don't know why. So Umesi one is here. This is what is giving us issue now. Umesi one image. That's the, that's the alternate text for the picture name. So this is the about page. And let me change it to Umesi. Umesi one dot jpg dot jpg. It's supposed to start showing now. Now I don't know what is going on. So let me save it again and then you can check. Someone should be able to check, please. Just refresh. See, go back to the home page and then refresh and check. Because I can't see nothing here. <sighs> Does it show? That means the image don't corrupt. So let me go pro. I'm trying to view from my phone progobium dot online. Let me see. Sometimes it's like that. It's just keep that is why when they charge you to, to build a site, they'll tell you okay, pay 250k. You'll be thinking it's not easy. Okay, I see it now. The image site actually is there, but thing is not showing. No problem. But 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 can you see his name is showing and then his uh, all this all the things that he can actually do is showing yeah. Uh -huh. Let me go and fix that nonsense that is trying to fuck everybody up here. Let me, I think it's supposed to be here. So, this is just the code that, that it was supposed to work on. This is the code. That's why they say if you don't know how to code, don't just come inside because you will mess everything up here. So, I think we can actually change it here to uh, I think the class is a uh, messy one. 
So I think after this one, I should start working. Check. I've saved. Check. Let's say we may see one. I've saved again. Check. Any updates for me? Any update for me? Come on, no. Let me see. It's like something was corrupted here. So don't no problem. I'll simply go back and import the don't worry, I'll just delete this. I will just delete this, you know. You know that as you also do surgery in your in your hospital, we also do surgery in site development. So I have to go and unzip the other file and then bring in that same copy of the file into the site so that I can actually do what I want to do. So uh the site is in my the folder is in my down, download folder. I will go to my download folder, which is here. Open the download. This is it. I will just unzip. I will unzip now so I can just download this one. This is index that is giving me headache. This is index that is giving me headache. So I will do what? I will just say okay. I'll just say open with what? Open with my notepad. Let me just. Okay, this is what it's showing now. Right? It's showing me like this. No problem. That is supposed to start working. What's up now? There's nothing wrong with what I've done here. Why is it giving us headache? Mr. Messi, are you there? Mr. Messi. Okay, no problem. Let me go back and get to the root of this whole stuff. Let me let me go back again and then go to the website and then open the root folder. It's open now, so I want to upload that same file again. And then I will need to be able to peel out that same thing. Oh, from a uh, former you there? It's on corrupted format, and then I want to upload it. A former you did there. A former blessing she don't come out. No problem. I'll catch them. So this is the folder now. I have to I have to just on okay, let me think. I'll cut I'll cut this one out here because I don't want it to corrupt everything that I have here. So I, want, I need to create a new I need to create a new uh folder here so that I can actually do what I want to do. So I'll create a new folder. A new directory and i'll call it uh, bash okay this is bash and then i'll open bash then i'll paste this thing there paste it here and then unzip it so i will unzip it yeah 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 because i want to copy one out so i'll come in here i'll copy this html i'll cut it then i'll go into the main folder delete this one that is here now delete it okay delete it out then i'll paste the other one here okay i've not pasted. please go and check and see let, let us see what is going on there just check let me and check so i can actually edit it and then we can go Say the normal original image don't come back abby yes okay so, so let me go back and edit it again so we can actually see it working now let me just confirm the image i'm going to use so i'll come back to my I am ng page so mr umesis means you don't come out mr Messi, your picture don't okay yeah because i changed you know i changed the default i changed that html file that is the, the file that controls everything here. so you can i think i know why the thing is not working the see the thing here is that the jpg that is here is actually capital letter why the one i'm i i entered there is small letter. i think that's the reason that is what caused everything so let me now come back and fix as a what as a doctor so i'll come here and i'll do what it did and i'll come in there and i'll say okay diva folio no is uh umesi umesi what he said this god's will yeah that is it and then i'll come down a bit to come to the bottom of course he said this a brick layer uh say dev dev sec ops engineer and uh, see 
realtor and he said content creator no content creator no be facebook oh no then he also does what import import and export please are you are, are people paying attention here so i can see how it's done because nothing just be if they tell you they're going to design your site so that is how they do it too so now the next one can be what let you leave it as what app developer so we'll now come back here and then we'll say okay what is his name it's okay his name is this his name is his name is umesi i have to be careful this time because i don't want to repeat it again so I think my machine is going down. Umesi God's will. Yeah, that's his name. And I want to put his image here. And today you must if you not work here now, wahala. I for my you there. If this is not work here, oh god, you are finished. So Umesi one. I'll come here and change. You see this thing that is here. I have to change it to capital letter. That, 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 that's the reason why it did not work in the first place. I didn't take note of it so change it to what jpg capital letter and then change the name to what to umesi umesi one so i've not saved yet so don't check huh? so that is where then there's another one again mm, this is this one and i think here as well so she's umesi one and then capital dot jpg dot jpg and let me just change it to Umesi. Umesi one. I don't need any errors this time because my battery is already down. So Umesi one. Okay. Now I think we can have it online now. If you not work, eh? <laughs> ah, God. If you not work, you have, in fact, all of you are going to give me two two five each this night. Oh yeah, check. Someone should check for me. Let me see. Show you now, Abby. His face, Abby. Okay, that is it, boy. So, is anybody that is not seeing it again? Can it? Can I mean, can, can can you all see it now? I think the image is too. Long. Yeah, I know. I know. Yeah, it's too big. I understand. It's too big. But then, if you, I should actually change it down to what it was, or you know. So let me just try and see. Okay, I still have like 20, okay, 25 minutes. Let me just go back and do what I have to do first. So now look at it now. See, for me to be able to make it to confirm to what it was before, so I have to go back to the file that was, you know, to the file that was there originally. I have to go and know what the dimension is and then format the new one to meet that, to, you know, to be able to meet that dimension. If not, it will, be, it will keep giving us that, that bogus image there. So this is the image that was here before. Let me... Uh, see the properties and then see what it was like so i think it is a an 800 by 1000 pixel file so i have to change mr macy's own to 800 by what by 1000 so 800 by 1000 so to edit his own i will go back to mr macy's picture this is it here i will tell it to what to edit it with notepad so i will open it with notepad or paint yes paint then i'll do what i'll do resize and come to pixel Maintain aspect and then I'll put what eight hundred by what a thousand. How come that one there is actually bigger than this one? How come is come off it? Something is wrong here. The other one that we that is on site now is bigger than this. Is is in terms of size bigger than this one? What? How come it's not showing properly? What will be the problem? Anyway, shall we guys should understand the way it's, it is now? Shall be let me change it back to something else. Let me change it to like let's say uh 620 by uh maybe 480. No, 480. Yeah, this one can work. Let's go. No, 600 by let's say this one. Ouch, it's bigger. Let me resize again. Uh come here horizontal should be horizontal should be like 420 this one should be like 620 let's see oops so it's nowhere no vex eh? 
I just want to demonstrate something here. Yeah? No vex. No go tell your village people say me they can't catch me. Oh, I not do. They don't go see me. Oh, I go disappear. So I will go back to my server now and do what and upload that same image once again because I must what I must achieve this thing tonight. Hmm. Oh God, drop. What I go so. Now I have to do what? Remove this one now. Do what? Click on it and what? Delete. And then I'll do what? Import the other one. So I'll import the other one into it. So upload it. I'll come to the, my desktop. And here we have him. So let us bring it in. And we now do what? We have him now. So we just have to name it what? Mr. Umesi. So upload. It's not there yet. It's there now, Abi. So let us now check if it is if it is if it is not showing well. Please let's check. Can we check if it is showing? Why oh, the ladies are not quiet? What's here happen? Why are they quiet? I think it's better now, Abi. What? I'll. I'll... I've just resized it. He didn't provide this one initially. Let me just provide, you know, you know, I have to provide this one for myself. So let me just get this one for myself. Let me get this one for myself. So, uh, you know, on a, you know, on a normal photo shoot, you know, they will tell you the kind of picture that you, you have to do or they have to provide, you know, the dimension. So I think it's not showing well. If you, if you cannot see it on your normal view, change it to desktop view on your phone to be able to see it correctly. So it's showing properly now. I think so. So the next thing that we need to do now is what is to change the other thing that are here. Yeah, I know. <laughs> no, no, nah, don't worry. This one is not your site. You know, we are just trying to demonstrate something here, sir. Okay. Do you understand? Hello. Uh -huh. So, so this is just how it is. So, if I want to do something again now, so anything I want to do now is what I have to go and edit the word that index file is where everything that is going to be happening. So whatever you want to change now, like, okay, now you say he has experience and talking about all those, all those other stuff, like maybe his work experience, I can actually edit all, all that one here. So you say, learn about me. So I can say, okay, learn about uh, Umesi. Okay. And then say he had 10 years of experience. I can say, okay, no, he has just five years of what? Of experience. And then you see everything that they wrote here, blah, 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 blah can change everything. I just as I'm doing it, so, so if you're going to do it on your own now, I have to make you understand something that actually every server have their own word interface. This one now is a, a panel. It's a server on its own. I also have another one that is called cloud panel that I use here. And then if you do it on a C panel, it will be a word different interface. Sometime now, I can just copy everything here and do what? Take it to my what? To my, maybe to my maybe to my notepad and do what? And edit everything there and do what? And then upload it back to the server. See, I can actually come here and edit everything here. See the way it is here. I can edit everything here and then do what? Take it back to the server and do what? And upload it there. And it will still be showing me as it's supposed to show me. So that is just how it is with what with development. You can see the entire thing is just here. Okay, so that is just me to show you how to what how, how to build your what your site. So I'm going to have to upload this video for you guys to watch and then use to particularize. But the issue you're going to have is what a server. You don't have a server. And if you go and deploy this on your cloud, they will charge you shaggy. Okay, so that is just what is going to happen. So I'm going to upload this for you guys. So you can actually do what you can work with it and then be able to try to learn a bit. Okay, so that's where we're going to stop this class for today.